Tatis. What's going on guys? My name is Mark and welcome back to Retro Heat. I don't know if you guys watched it, but I just got done watching game two of the Padres Cardinals playoffs and Tatis went off not once, twice. Perfect timing too, because I got a Tatis mail day today. Let's check it out. All right guys, here we go. Pretty excited over this. Perfect timing too, because a lot of this is uh, Tatis. And I just got done watching that um, playoff game where he had two home runs, which was pretty amazing. Very nice comeback from my Padres. Check out this first card. It's a little mixture of everything actually, but we'll see. First up to bat, we got some Jimmy Butlers. Optics. I mean, it's pretty crazy how cheap Jimmy Butler cards go for. I think I paid like $1.50 each plus shipping. So not bad at all. Not a bad start. Go, number two. And it looks like some more Jimmy Butlers. We got this Go Hard or Go Home prism. Numbered 25 of 49. Not bad, looking pretty good. And then we got this one. Jimmy Butler prism, red prism out of 350. Not bad. I've been picking up Jimmy Butler lately just because, you know, he's been undervalued for so long. And he's such a good player, so why not? Speaking of which, here's another one. I believe there's two of them. It's just the red, white, and blue prism. Not bad at all. So that's six Jimmies. I promise you some Tatis. Let's go. Okay. First up to bat, we got the Rookie Debut, debut, 150 year stamp. Not a bad rookie card. I think I paid $14 for it, which is pretty crazy because Tati's rookie cards have been going down. But I bought the dip. It looks good to me. That's one Tatis. Next. I don't know what this is. I've seen some more Padre cards, but... Let's see. The Nielsen and the Met. Too bad he's injured for the playoffs. Could use his arms. Hedges. And there you go. Manny being Manny. That's pretty cool. But I bought this card. 2030 insert. Not a big time card. I think it was only a two dollar shipped but it has a really nice look to it so why not all right next
next up to bat we got there you go the prism chrome rookie tatis bought it on the dip i think i paid 65 70 dollars for it again not bad at all and i'm pretty sure the prices will go up after Playoff game. Nice. Next. And we got the Bowman Chrome insert. Top 100 insert. Again, another uh, affordable Tatis insert. So why not add it to the collection? Not bad at all. Next. It. We have a Magic Johnson 92-93 Tops Gold. And let's see its condition. It looks pretty good. The reason why I bought this one was because it's really it looked really nicely centered in the pictures. And it still looks really nicely centered. Edges and corners don't seem dinged. I have to look it over better, but this might be a gradable one. Not bad. And I think we have three more. How do you open this thing? Okay. And another Tatis rookie card. This is his finest refractor. Not bad. Like I said, I bought the dip hard. Trying to pick up some of his rookie cards on the cheap and it looks like I was able to and this one is a pretty cool one you got two of the 410 variation rookie cards Gemman 10s I mean these dip down to about 45 50 bucks. I scooped up two of them Can't complain with that Not bad at all These are gonna go into the vault and Let's see what they're worth in about 20 years, right? And last but not least We have, I have No idea what this is They wrapped it up fairly nicely. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I remember. We got the Tatis Chrome. Rookie card, short print variation. Refractor. Nice. I've been wanting to add this one to my collection for a while, but 
price just shot up to amazing levels for a while. Came back down a little bit, so I was able to pick one up. Send this guy off to PSA for grading. Hopefully it gets a PSA 10. But, I mean, we already got two PSA 10s. We got the Tatis 203. 410 variation finest rookie card Fernando Tatis Jr. finest rookie card refractor you got the Bowman Chrome top 100 you got the Prism rookie card looks awesome you got the 2030 insert you have the 150 year stamp rookie debut debut not bad got the magic johnson tops gold and you got the jimmy butler's prism cards one two three four five six not bad at all guys there you go I'm super glad I bought Tatis on the dip and hope they do good tonight. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Don't forget, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Peace.